Hey everybody, it's Jeff from New York, and today we're on the Las Vegas Strip, the northern end of the Las Vegas Strip. We're going to check out the Venetian Hotel and Casino. The Venetian is part of a huge complex, including the Palazzo Hotel and Casino, as well as the Grand Canal shops that connect the two. The Venetian is also well known for those gondola rides with the singing gondoliers. They go not only outside here in the front of the hotel and casino, but also inside through the Grand Canal shops. The artwork and marble work in this hotel and casino are simply stunning, so let's uh, walk around and check out what this place has to offer, shall we? Here's the reception area at the Venetian. It's been a while since I've been to the Venetian or the Palazzo and Grand Canal shops as a vlogger with a camera. When I first came to Vegas several years ago as a vlogger, I stayed at the Palazzo and I was just simply overwhelmed with the beauty and the uh, luxury at these two hotels and casinos. When I checked in several years ago as a vlogger at the uh, Palazzo, the first place I stayed at, I was thinking to myself, wow, this is incredible. Is every place in Vegas like this? And I quickly learned the answer is no. As far as luxury high-end hotels and casinos here on the Las Vegas Strip, I always considered the Bellagio the centerpiece, while the Wynn and Encore were always considered by me to be a understated classy act. But when I think about the Venetian and the Palazzo, what comes to my mind is over-the-top luxury. And yes, even over-the-top luxurious hotels and casinos have a food court. This is the Venetian's. Obviously, the Venetian has tons of places to eat, but when it comes to quick bites and this food court in particular, you'll find a Bananos New York Pizzeria here, a San Gennaro Burger, a Tacos and Rita, a Eats Italian, as well as a Cafe Pan. This is Mitzi the Rubber Ducky Showgirl who shows up on all my Vegas videos. As most of you know, there are hidden mascots, or some of you call them Easter eggs, in my videos. Mitzi shows up in all the Vegas ones. Sometimes she's easy to spot, other times she's quite elusive, so keep your eyes open while watching the video. If you spot her, note the time in the comments below, and if you're the first one, you'll get a shout out on an upcoming video. <laughs> Notte giorno di torno girano, delle belle trovando al riposo, ma ci si è trovato cibo d'amor. Delle belle trovando al riposo, ma ci si è trovato cibo d'amor. Non più vrai questi bei panachini, quel cap. Pello leggero galante, quella chioma, quell'orio brillante, quel vermiglio donesco color, quel vermiglio donesco color. Non più frai, quei penachini, quel cappello, quella chioma, quell'orio brillante. Coming up here is Black Tap Craft Burgers and Beer, created by Vegas veteran Chris Barish. Black Tap Craft Burgers and Beer is one of the uh, new takeouts on a classic burger joint with a downtown vibe. Award-winning Craft Burgers, famous Crazy Shake milkshakes, and they are crazy, folks. Craft beer as well as cocktails. Here's a Venetian race and sports book. They're playing French cafe music here. That's rather odd for the Venetian. Hey, if you're enjoying this video, please hit that subscribe button and smash that thumbs up. It really does help the channel out. This is Noodle Asia. Enjoy the game on the big screen while sharing dim sum and delicious authentic noodles next to the race and sports book. The menu features large portions of noodle dishes, vegetarian specialties, rice and kanji dishes, and soups. Choose from oriental favorites such as barbecue pork and roast duck noodles and broth, Singapore vermicelli, shrimp fried rice, as well as other fried noodle specialties with vegetables, seafood, beef, and chicken. 
Hola Chica! Chica delivers the robust and vibrant flavors of Latin cuisine combined with a dynamic wine and mixology program. This is the Dorsey Cocktail Bar. Step into the Dorsey Cocktail Bar and you'll have your Las Vegas nightlife experience transformed. Located in the Venetian Casino, if you're searching for classic cocktails, the Dorsey has you covered. This Want the World wall here appears to be temporary. There seems to be some construction on the other side, but in the meantime, it creates a nice photo opportunity. Coming up here is Yardbird Southern Table and Bar. A modern take on Southern comfort means shared plates, craft cocktails, critically acclaimed fried chicken, and an ideal place for brunch or dinner. And on the other side of Yardbird is Sugar Cane Raw Bar and Grill. It opened in 2016 and it's a restaurant and raw bar serving daily brunch, fire grilled fare, small plates and more. Guests are welcome to kick back, eat well and stay a while. Don't forget to check out my book 50 Attractions and Many Tips When Visiting Las Vegas. It's down at the bottom in the description of this video that you're watching. It's only $4.99 instantly download it to your computer tons of pictures and fantastic tips if you plan on visiting sin city hey look a starbucks who would have thought we'll get another shot at a sugarcane well bar and grill from a different angle looks like they have a happy hour isn't every hour a happy hour in Las Vegas? And that's pretty much it here for the Venetian today. Stay tuned for the uh, Palazzo and Grand Canal Shop videos coming up shortly. Coming up next on the New York Channel. I recently stayed at the Borgata in Atlantic City and I wanted to give you guys a room tour as well as the pool here at the Borgata and show you what it's all about. I hope you enjoyed this video and if you did please like, comment, ask some questions and most importantly subscribe by clicking on the button on the left. You can visit all of my New York videos by clicking on the top right, or check out my videos on other favorite places to visit by clicking on the bottom right. Thanks for watching and I'll see you around the city.